Hey guys, this is Aiden from TheAssetHole.com, your one-stop shop for 2D game graphics. Really excited to roll out our first ever game solid template. This is going to allow your apps to resize automatically to any device size. It's also got some extras in there, some joysticks and interface configurations. So this is a really awesome template to get started making any app. So I made a little mock-up project just to show off this template. So this whole thing's set up in the iPad screen size. And what's going to happen is when this shows up on another device, GameCell is going to chop the top and bottom off. So I made a special class of actors that will stay pinned to the top and the bottom and read the screen size and move accordingly. So if we switch these over to the different screen sizes, you see that it's chopped the top and bottom off, but our HED elements have stayed uh, in the view. So I'm just going to go through these really quickly so you can see all the different screen sizes and these stay relatively in the same place. Another great part of this template is the ability to change these different interfaces. This is so awesome when you're starting an app and you don't have to recode these joysticks every single time. There's a couple different ones in here and it's really easy to get started on any game. So right now we have um, one that moves in the three, 360 degrees and we have one that shoots 360 degrees. And this can be uh, set to a, a tank turret or any kind of other uh, rotation that you need to set it to. So I mapped this out in a table called user controls. And there's a few things in here, we'll just run through it really quickly. Um, the player one camera control, that's uh, you know the ability for the player one to control the camera. Uh, max speed, this changes the speed obviously. The joystick left and right, which we have set to true. Um, I'm going to go ahead and turn off joystick right um, and set it to buttons. We have the option of one, two, zero, one, or two buttons. Right now it's set to zero, so we're going to set it to two. We'll take a look at that. Now that hooks, hooks us up with two buttons, and right now they're just set to shoot two different projectiles. Another option in here. Open that up is to turn these off completely. I'm going to turn off the camera control and turn it to invisible right and left. I'm just going to tweak this just a little bit. Put this guy down here. So this are these two areas are going to allow him to move right or left. It's really great for like a brick bash kind of game or a space invaders. It's really great. This is all, whoops, our buttons are still on. Turn that to zero. Sorry about that. Here we go. One more time. Here we go. So this is really great for like a Space Invaders or something like that. And it's already set up. It's in every template. You just got to turn those off. If you don't want any of them on, just turn them all off. And it just starts with nothing and you can set your own controls on there. So I'm going to quickly go ahead and reset this up with two controllers. Put this guy back up here. So another great thing about this template is I've coded in Game Center to it already and set it up. Right now it's set up with a high score and three achievements, and you can add any number of achievements beyond this. So all we have to do is turn on Game Center. You're going to want to put in, you turn whichever ones of these you want on. So right now we got high score, and I'll just turn them all on, three achievements. Um, for the high score, you just want to put in your ID. For the achievements, you put in the score that you want it to, you want to trigger that achievement, and the ID for it. So right now we're going to preview this one more time difference. So I got some bad guys over here, some satellites to blow up that are gonna, I don't know why I put them so far away from the action. Here we go. Maybe it was to show you that super awesome parallax I coded. So here we go. We're gonna shoot these guys here and you see our scores going up and we're gonna hit that and it's gonna trigger the first achievement. Obviously it doesn't show it in here. So this is gonna be good for game center and game circle. So that's it for this little demo. Head on over to the acidhole.com to check out this template. Um, it's going to be included with a landscape version of this project, a portrait version of this project, and a whole tutorial video to show you how everything works. I also put tons of notes into this project and labeled everything so it's going to be really easy to navigate. Uh, this is not going to come with these graphics, it's going to come stock and blank. 
You can always head over to the assethole.com. We have tons of graphics, 2D graphics for video games. We have characters, animations, backgrounds, all sorts of stuff like that. And don't forget to sign up for our mailing list because the store is growing every day and we got all kinds of new stuff and we're gonna have great deals coming down the pipe for you. So thanks a lot guys and have fun with this one.